York traders. Let's take a look at this Euro Swiss chart. Got what we asked for this morning. A move through 20. Sort of an annoying move back down to 16 this hour, but it looks like we're making new highs again. The year's high in Euro Swiss is 37. This looks very likely to get pierced today, especially if boons are trading below 70. Got to keep this in mind. Sterling weakness did not materialize in the European session. We've basically been trading on the top side of this range, up between 75 and 85 for the last couple of hours. <coughs> 87 was the high. We still like this lower, and we think the best way to reflect it is buying Euro Sterling through 90. Bitcoin was very quiet very small range looks like we're heading into some sort of Christmas lull equities marginally higher not a lot to say here we are going to wait on third quarter GDP readings and we're just going to take our cues from the stock market and the bond market today euro yen made new highs it's turned a little bit here but still very bid 45 is the bull bear pivot for today. 134.45. Dollar Swiss is quietly cruising higher. This is a very important point here, 98.85. This probably will bleed through at the same time Euro Swiss gets through 37. So keep an eye on that. There might be an opportunity to make some money and the setup should be somewhat obvious as both should be near the highs at the same time. CAD yen is kind of interesting only because we have Canadian numbers out today. This high 88.55 uh, would be your way to buy Canadian strength. If we get Canadian weakness you just want to buy dollar CAD. That's it for now. Two more trading days, really, till the end of the year. Uh, not too many people are going to be working next week. So, good luck. Be nimble out there. And we will see you tomorrow at the European Open. Privateer FX is out. Ciao.